Hi, I'm CJ and this is my RC channel. This is my overdue seasonal update. Uh, end of summer, beginning of fall and into the beginning of winter uh, for the year 2024. Um, sorry guys, I'm way overdue getting back into videos. As some of you know, um, my parents passed away. My mother uh, died September of last year. Uh, she was my last uh, parent to pass away and I had a lot of work to do taking care of the estate and my wife and I bought a new home and uh, getting us moved was a tremendous amount of work, packing up all the hobby stuff, um, getting moved into this uh, new house, much larger house, uh, and uh, that was a lot of work. We're still getting settled. I'm still getting the hobby room set up. Um, as you can uh, kind of see here, there's a lot of new stuff going on here. So it's coming together bit by bit. Uh, there's a whole outer room uh, where I have set up a uh, mini Z track, the 50 centimeter panel. And I just ordered the widening kit for that. So it's gonna be 150 millimeter wide. Um, hopefully uh, I've already got one friend who's coming over here and driving with me. My wife's been uh, playing with the cars a little bit, having some fun with a ready set. So uh, hopefully um, I'll have a few more friends coming over to do some driving and uh, get some regular practice in. There's a couple of local places in the area that have some racing. So I'll be getting some uh, footage of that for you guys. I'm building a couple of different Mini Z cars, a couple of high-end cars, um, one by uh, GL, uh, one by Atomic, and I'll do full builds on those. Um, interesting uh, events coming up. There is a national race being held very close by, and that is for vintage uh, off-road car racing, which is uh, kind of starting to get big. Um, it's getting a lot of buzz. A lot of people are getting interested in it. Um, so I picked up three cars. One of them has yet to arrive. Should be here in a couple of days. Uh, I have the associated RC10T. Uh, the one that hasn't arrived yet is the original RC10 Gold Pan. Um, and uh, for the all-wheel drive buggy class, the, uh, the Super Dogfighter four-wheel drive Yokoma YZ870C. I believe this is legal. I have yet to confirm that. I have another all-wheel drive, the uh, uh, Optima. So um, I may uh, try to build that as well, but I'm gonna try to field these three cars um, the basic rules are pretty thin. Um, I don't think you're allowed to do a lot of mods. The main thing is motor. And for the two-wheel drive, uh, buggy and truck, 17.5 brushless motors. Electronics are pretty much whatever you want. So you can use a high-end ESC, which is going to allow for a lot of programmability. I think that's going to be the main advantage uh, is going to be trying to dial that ESC so um, you get a lot of control out of that power system. Uh, set it up so that uh, it's not uh, brutalizing the powertrain, breaking things. Um, these cars are going to be very delicate compared to uh, current day vehicles. So uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, let's see. There's, uh, there's a whole lot coming up here. I've got a couple of trips planned. I've got a uh, two boats. Um, one of them, at least, I'm gonna be taking to the Outer Banks in the next, oh, I would say four weeks. 
Uh, I'm going to go down for at least a couple of days and I'm going to be taking a couple of my uh, large scale off-road cars to blast around on the sand dunes and out on the beach. Uh, going to bring at least one friend with me and uh, so have a couple of cars running at the same time. Uh, have uh, at least a couple of cameras going at the same time so it should make for some interesting footage, a lot of fun. Uh, some cool videos coming at you. So uh, hopefully the uh, amount of videos, the quality of videos, everything is going to step up uh, over the next two or three months. Um, it's going to take me a little time to, you know, get all this uh, footage cut and produced and out to you. But um, I appreciate everyone who has uh, been patient with me and uh, still subscribes and uh, occasionally stops in and makes a comment from time to time. Um, I, uh, uh, I'm sorry it took so long to get back. Uh, as some of you know, I am disabled. I've had a you know bad motorcycle accident has left me uh, in permanent pain and disabled. but I do what I can as, uh, as fast as I can. So as you can imagine moving in this condition has been rough. So um, again, I'm uh, I've got a lot of projects on deck, not just what you see here. Uh, I've been doing some building. Um, but I've got a lot of airplanes, um, I've got a lot of cars, uh, crawlers, everything. I've been stocking up kits that I've been wanting to build and just putting them away for when I had time and uh, waiting for the, uh, the, the hobby basement to get finished. So um, can't wait to uh, get all this stuff done and out to you guys. So. Um, Please uh, click like, please subscribe if you haven't already, and uh, get ready for some fun videos and some great builds. Thank you.